This is OPIC Roundabout in Okeilewo, Abekuta, the capital of Ogun State, southwest Nigeria. And under construction on this 19,000 square meters of land is the second largest city center in Nigeria, a chain store of consumer goods and other social amenities like a mall, service center, commercial banks and more. It's not the first in Ogun State, but certainly promises to be the biggest and it's a world-class model. We did daughter. It's fantastic. I mean, people, you, I would, I can, you cannot imagine the amount of people that applied for jobs in that place. So we've started this now, you know. We believe in 24 months, you know, because this is going to be the second largest shopping center. So it's not something that is going to be easy, you know. I will be honest with you. In 24 months, we should, we, we are wondering, thinking, or we might do it in phases. So before that, a phase might be opened, you know. Then the second phase will be open. Everything will be completed in 24 months. On completion, the city center is expected to serve as a one-stop shop for all consumer needs. Also, the employment opportunities of the facility is massive. We are not a one-town state. So we're going to be going from area to area doing this kind of regional projects. And we hope that by, with this and with all the efforts and infrastructure we're doing, we're going to be attracting people to come and live here, to come and live here, to come and work here, to come and recreate in Ogu State, and this is the, a, 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 the first step towards that. The state government is optimistic that this facility will further drive the revenue generation plan of the government, attract more investors, and improve the lifestyle of the people. This is the city center, Adekuta city center. What we have here uh, is world class, it's going to be, and uh, we have an arena just like the O2 arena in uh, England. Uh, we have hotel, budget hotel here. We have a lot of things that is anchored here. And I have to thank and appreciate the efforts of uh, all of our people. And OTA today is a success story. The government is playing its part, but of course it will be largely private sector driven. So clearly it means that we are getting some things right, and that's why people are identifying with us. Everybody believes in what we are doing, and that's why they are keen to it. So I'm happy, I'm thrilled. And the icing on the cake for me is that I think too now uh, there have been all these gigantic projects. They have been done by uh, what I call the son of the soil. And as citizens anticipate the second largest city center in Nigeria, the brains behind the project have the responsibility to ensure that it lives up to its billing.